Good afternoon everybody, my name is Crystal and welcome to my YouTube channel. Um, it's absolutely boiling hot inside and outside. I'm sweating buckets. Alexa, what's the time please? It's 2.55pm. This is not the weather to have arguments, is it? Or try and pick a fight with somebody, it isn't, is it? Heat rage. Good afternoon everybody, um, I have just taken Max out for a very slow afternoon walk, he wanted to go out, he's got a, like a clock inside him and we go out in the morning, in the afternoon and in the evening and I was quite happy to sit down and let him have a rest but he wanted to go out, he wandered by the front door and he wanted to go out so I took him out. Um, after what I'd been through in the co-op, bullying and Mickey taking again. I, I, I mean, this is this is what I get on a daily basis, and it used to crush me. It used to upset me. I used to hide my head and stay indoors, but now I don't give a fuck because I've been listening to people on TikTok. I've been listening to motivational quotes. Life is short, and they just want to stop me speaking, and I'm not going to go along with abuse. If, if, if something is wrong, I'm not going to shut my mouth and cover it up like they did to me. No, I'm not. Don't use me in pornography. Don't use me in your silly scenarios. And then I won't act stupid and mess it up for you, will I? <laughs> and I tell you now, guys, I've got nothing with the lesbian, transgender homosexual community you know I, 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 I make friends with everybody disabled gay straight but I am NOT gay and I'm a woman I'm a female and this is a woman's handbag feeler which I got from Dykeman in Chatham and it's a woman's handbag and this all stems from going up to see my mum once a week, doesn't it? Because I look like my father. I look like my dad. And I would do, because I was his daughter, wasn't I? His wife, Jennifer, doesn't look like him because she was his wife. I was his daughter. And daughters look like their dads and sons look like their mothers. It's a well-known saying. So I know what happened at Go Train when I was assaulted by a man and there was a, a bloke that looked like uh, one of Dad's workers at Brompton Barracks in Go Train called Gary. So I do know what's going on and why they keep parking little red cars outside my bedroom window like my dad's. Never, if you see someone being abused, hit in the street, or subjected to fucking hate crime, don't shut your mouth. And it's no good telling me to shut up, because the more people tell me to shut up, the more I won't shut up. Right? You don't push me about. <laughs> so, two o'clock. I went out of this flat and I went downstairs and I looked in my mailbox, number five. And I'll show you what I've got in my mailbox. I'm Crystal, my hair is not black, it's coffee brown. And I'm a woman. Be a hero for nature. Our world needs us like never before. Thankfully, there are so many ways that you can help. And it's got a picture of a panda. The World Wildlife Fund. Fundraising Regulator. Woking in Surrey. 
we've got a railway card here southeastern the key the key it's got my name on it crystal welcome to the key your contactless smart card Follow these quick and easy steps to buy and download your tickets from home so you can fast track through the station and avoid the queues. You can also activate Flexi Season tickets using the South Eastern app. Download the South Eastern app from the Apple Store or Google Play. Log into your account where you can buy single return Season and Flexi Season tickets. Load your ticket straight onto the key by holding or scanning the smart card onto the back of your phone after purchase. So I've got the key South Eastern Railway card. Finally, we have a small package, second class, Royal Mail, large letter, 45 grams, from Jupiter House in Mitcham. It's my green glasses case. I bought this from eBay, it's a green glasses case. Only a few quid. It's a lot better than the glasses case I got from Boots. So there's my glasses. Go in the case. They won't get broken, will they? And then you've got a little key bit so how you can hang them on your trousers. Put them in my handbag. There's a couple of blokes. There was a couple of blokes in the cop um, this afternoon with their handbags. A couple of men. While I was waiting to get to, to the self-service checkout, there was a couple of uh, gay blokes together. There's nothing wrong with that. Nothing wrong with that at all. I'm just saying that I'm not gay and I'm not a bloke. And it's okay to take the piss out of me because at least you're not doing it to someone that's less stronger than I am and who can take it. So I went out of my flat in the hot sunshine. Max and I went onto the field and there was a man in a hoodie in this heat. A black hooded jacket with the hood over his head sat on a bench in this heat. So I walked around the field slowly and I think Max had changed his mind and he wanted to go home. So when I got three quarters of the way around the field, I picked him up. I picked him up to carry him um, home. All that I encountered on the field was a young lady with long black hair with a co-op plastic bag and she was eating in front of me, eating. And there was a bloke, a man, that looked like he had a lady's straw hat on. And he was walking a pug dog. Just one pug dog. And that was it, really. Then when I was coming off the field, somebody started laughing by Costa Co Coffee. And they soon shut up. I said they soon shut up. And then another couple, and he was talking to his girlfriend, and he went, shut up. Like my dad used to say to my mum, he told her to shut up. So they're still playing silly buggers. I don't go out to meet anybody after what Charlie did to me. I go out to walk my dog, and I've got a lot stronger, and I'm not going to put up with that behaviour anymore. No, I won't shut my mouth and I won't put up with being abused.
my dad just sat there and, and took it. He just so, sat in the chair and took it and took it and took it and took it. Being laughed at and made fun of. Well, I fucking don't. And I don't like it. Where, where is this, where's this that I'm a bloke coming from? I know a load of people get it on TikTok. And you can quite blatantly see, when women get older, we get older. There's nothing we can do about it. Right? You get wrinkles, you get old. Right, you either accept yourself or you fucking hide away. And I fucking ain't hiding away, thank you very much. And what amazes me, the people that are laughing and making fun of me, they're nothing special at all. They just didn't look in the mirror this morning or this afternoon when they left. Because they, they're fucking full of themselves. These people that take the mickey. Look in the mirror at yourself. I have never, ever, ever been anything special to look at. And it makes you work fucking harder to accomplish what you want to achieve. Right? If you don't like me, that is not my problem. I've said that. So don't follow me about acting like cunts, because you'll get fucking brushed off like shit. <laughs> if, if, do you notice they do it? They do it from across the road. They'll take the piss from across the road or out the way. Because if they fucking said it to your face, they'd fucking run. <laughs> Man, they're nothing but a bunch of miserable cowards. That's all they are. I don't even take any notice of them. I just turn my back on them and get on with what I'm doing. Just because I wear a pair of shorts. If I went out there dressed like a bag lady, they'd be laughing their fucking heads off. They wouldn't be miserable hiding under hoods. <laughs> so I've come back from taking Max out for a walk. I've got some post. Um, yeah, other people going off in taxis, good luck to you. I don't want to swelter in a hot car, thank you. And I don't want to be moaned and shouted at either. So I'm quite happy. I have spent £15 in the co-op getting cool food, which will last me at least today and tomorrow. I'm being wise, not reckless with what I've got. And there's nothing to moan and complain about. But if you want to stand there and like, Shut up! You shut up. If you don't like what I'm saying, don't watch my videos. And if you if you don't like what I'm saying, don't don't fucking do things like that to me, you know? Don't take the piss out of me. I ain't gonna stand there and take it. And I'm not gonna go along with it. I'll ruin it. If I think you're doing some sort of fucking weird shit, I'm gonna make sure it's ruined. I'm not joining in with it. How would you like it? You're, you're a woman. You've been a woman all your life. You've been married. You've had four kids. And you get some banana spreading rumours that you're a bloke and you're gay. So you get followed by gay blokes. Because that's what that Charlie was, wasn't he? A gay bloke. Someone had put him up to it. Do I look like a bloke? I know these blokes walk around and they've got big chests, but these are breasts and I've got, I, I've got something missing. 
and I don't mind all the mickey taking, but you're going to look fucking fools. You really are. Absolute morons. Max is flat out, but he wanted to go out. I, I was quite happy to sit indoors. I know what it's like outside. And I certainly don't want to lose my temper in this heat. <laughs> and then I'm not being stopped going out anymore. If I want to go out, I'll go out. But I don't want to go shopping in this heat. I don't want to go into town in this heat right now. And uh, they're just stupid eating in front of me when I, I you know, I had strawberries. I, I had a bo got a punnet of strawberries, stuffing food in, in their faces when they're walking past me, and I got a, got a punnet of strawberries. They they can't do anything. They they think because I, because my mum's not sending me any money out, I can't cope. Well, I'm not two years old, right? And um, I'm quite happy sitting next to a fan rather getting my ears burnt with hatred and nasty things. I'm, I'm fine. I, and as for being by myself, I can do what I like. I can go out when I want. I can do what I want. I can say what I want. Uh, and it's complete freedom. I mean, if you can ignore these pests, these the pestilence, that follows you about trying to make you miserable uh, and you just turn your back on it you just treat them how they've treated you so they ignore me they pretend I don't exist they make out I'm ugly and, and I you know what I mean so I just treat them how they treat me so when they start spouting bollocks I turn around and turn my back on them and completely ignore them because that's what they do to me. Don't take any notice of me. I've been trod on. I've had trolleys in, in me. They don't apologise. They're rude. Just to try and get a reaction. And, I, you know, what I mean is I w I'd, I'm not like them. I wouldn't go and bash them back with a trolley because they'd bash me with it. But you can kill people with kindness, you know. You can kill them with kindness. You know, if someone comes up to you and, and starts something, just smile in their face and say, yeah, that's right. Uh, why aren't you reacting? Because I'm fucking better than you are. See you later, guys. Don't let anything get you down. You only live one life, live it, and other people's opinions don't fucking matter. See you later.